Boy Jumper, thank you for doing here. Welcome to be back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Hopefully everybody's going and doing well today. We are going to go fight Anne and we're going to go get some other things and some encounters and some things and stuff. And oh my god, there's a lot of things. Okay, let's go. <laughs> um, I actually was so... I know, I'm not even going to front. I was so half tempted to like literally start this episode by going like... Oh, I have to wait seven seconds. Hold on. I can't break YouTube's guidelines. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, I was gonna preface this episode by being like, what's going on, bitches? How are you doing today? And I'm like, this that's not a, the John that I know at all. <laughs> like, why would I just straight up be like, what's going on, bitches? How are you doing today? Hopefully we all having a wonderful day. I'm like, yeah, I can admit, and I can be the first to admit, I've had a rough day, so that might be impairing my judgment. But... <laughs> But we will definitely see how far it gets impacted in today's episode. Um, no, but today has been one of those days where it's like, I definitely can only record one episode. Because you get to a point, you're doing things, you're doing stuff, and you're like, Ugh, it's, drain it's draining. But like, I work in the hospitality industry, so like, you get drained constantly from people. I'm an introvert, that's why, I'm sorry. Um, but as an introvert, I get, like, people just make me go, uh, like, why? Unless they're, you're my family or somebody I care about, then you literally can never drain me. Uh, and, well, I guess that's kind of false too, isn't it? I mean, anybody can drain anybody. Um, but, typically, it, it, there's a much harder line to follow. <laughs> well... God, that, uh, that whole entire that whole entire sequence could have just been taken out of context, and it could have been bad. But <laughs> uh, we have a lucky egg. God, this is an episode that you guys have all been waiting for—the episode that everything can get taken out of context, and it'll be funny. Um, oh, jeez, Louise. Ah, uh, we have Sammy. We have everybody. We have a team of interesting Pokemon, and. Uh, lots of things happening. Uh, like that long extended, uh, just anytime that I say something, Family Feud, uh, buzzer. Like, what is the first Pokemon to become a ground type? Let me know in the comment section below. That was such an easy question. I, you know... <laughs> That was intended to be hilariously difficult, and then I realized technically Rhydon was literally the first Pokemon to be made. And Rhydon's a ground type. So, literally, the very first Pokemon that was made was a ground type. You know, we love it. You know, it, it's the best. It's just the greatest show on turf. Who are still in the playoffs, by the way? Um, triggered. I'm only only half triggered though, because honestly, honestly, it's been very hilarious to see pictures of Eric Weddle. Yeah, like between Matthew Stafford getting a ring and wanting Matthew Stafford to get a ring, and pictures of Eric Weddle. That is the only reason I'm actually happy that the Rams are in the freaking postseason still. <laughs> like, the Rams are... Wait, yeah, no. The Rams are to me as the Bears are to Joy. Like, I cannot stand the Rams at all. I picked them to win the championship game, by the way. Um, let me know if I was wrong. and Let me know how terrible I was. I was probably like... I'm going to say that I went 1-1 one one this week. I do not think I went 2-0. So, and I think, I think I probably lost the Rams game. I'm sorry, but like, it was funny because in the picks, in the pickums, um, Joy ended up actually going with the Rams too. Because I am a statistician. I am somebody who looks at the analytics and picks via the stats, in most cases, and how the stats are going. And I finally went with the wing it. I don't care strategy, and because basically, and because or not that I don't care. That's not the right thing. The wing it. I don't care about the stats strategy because I care about the pickums, and I picked the right choice. 
I thought that Joy was going to pick the 49ers. Um, only because if I did wing it, then that's a, pos a very easily uh, possibility to win that game. But, alas, I went with Stafford. And she went with Stafford. Because we just want to see Stafford get a ring. Even though it's with the Rams. And I, it will make me die on the inside for like six months. But there's always next season. And, you know, again, it's the NFC West. Like, if, if the NFC West wins a playoff or the Super Bowl, it just continually proves that the NFC West is a great division. Especially in the NFC Conference. They have actually made the playoffs six out of the last ten times. That's crazy. Uh, think about like six out of the six out of the last ten times the NFC West has represented the NFC in the Super Bowl. Point blank, all said and done, all there, all the teams. Um, in the conference, besides the Cardinals, went to the Super Bowl twice. If, well, I say that, well, actually, okay, that's assuming the Rams win. But, what I mean by that is, like, yeah, if the Rams win, then every team besides the, uh, Arizona Cardinals have been to the, to the Super Bowl twice. Now, will their record be great? Seattle went 1-1. One one. San Fran went 0-2. Oh so, no. But also, does it matter? Yes, it does. It actually matters heavily. But, can I pretend it doesn't matter for the sake of my... For the sake of my statistic being correct, of course! Uh, skew the statistics to make them right all the time! That's what everybody else does, right? Oh my gosh! <laughs> wow, that was a statement and a half. But it also was not a false statement, so... Let me just, you know, talk about how, you know, we got a crit and how Brittany is the best mon now because she got a crit. No, like, literally, you can just say random things to fit whatever you want. And it's weird. It is crazy how much you can actually skew what people think based off of a simple statistic. Like, it's wild. It, it'd be wild. The, the, way, uh, the way that the universe works. And the way that everything works is insanity. It's just like... You could literally tell somebody, right? That... I'm trying to make up something, like, obviously fake for my point. Like... Watch, I'll come up with something obviously fake and then, like, in the now. And this obviously fake thing... Is gonna be not fake in, like, 20 years down the road. And I'll be like... That was a statement made 20 years ago. Like, okay. Okay, here we go. Um, math is the least analytical subject. Okay, obviously false. Obviously false. Like, can we all agree that math is very analytical? It's literally the point. Or one of the points. So, then, we can change it and be like, Two of three students that got an A in math went to get, uh, uh, went on to get some of the highest salary jobs. Oh, math is awesome now. Like, it, math, math goes from, oh, it's analytical, it's hard, and it might not be worth it, to then, oh, two out of three people who get A's in math get a high paying job. Let's focus on math and actually care about it and give a 
poop emoji. Like, just think about think about that for a second. Adding that statistic makes it actually cared about. And like in sport, the sports world does it all the time. And I am not. I am not uh, gonna say that oh, my stats are always facts. And what I talk about is always like yes. But like, you skew the statistics to fit the agenda that you want to have, right? Or you skew the statistics in order to make it look or seem like this is gonna be the way it should be. So, for example, um, the NFC West is the best division in football. Since 2002, they've had the most Super Bowl appearances. Okay. Which, actually, that's false, by the way. That's, again, another random statistic. That isn't true. But, like, at least I don't think it is. I haven't done the math on this. So, yeah, you have that. Okay? But then, that also doesn't account for the fact that they were the NFC least between 2000 and 8. Or, 2008, 2009, 2010. So, are they actually the best division in football? Over the last 20 years? No. So, like, you could be like, they went to the most Super Bowls. So, they're the best division in football. But are they really, though? Because does this them going to Super Bowls automatically make them better? And especially when we're talking about the division as a whole, we're not talking about a specific team in the division. So... But because the division has made it to the most Super Bowls, then they're, by proxy, going to have the best division in football over the last 20 years. Like, no. no. But again, it is all about stat skewing and making everything look right. This is not the Pokemon I wanted to have out. No! Ugh. I don't think... Okay. No, no, I, I'm gonna, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even going to entertain the idea that this is not a threat. I do not care, Jonas. I am not going to even, I'm gonna just continue with the way that I go with content. I, I know you're freaking out with me right now. But it's a freaking scissor, and our team can't handle that, okay? Like, ah, uh, Bitch lab. Um, anyway. <laughs> This is so bad. So, stuff is dying. Um, because it's part bug. I know it has U-turn. Gosh dang it. So I can only send in Troy, but Troy's injured, which is a problem because, you know, Troy's not fully healed. Oh, okay. I, I do believe I have to send in Tweedledee right here. Because will Brittany take hits? Yeah. Brittany will take, like, stuff. Ah, uh, but I don't want to risk Brittany. Okay. Plan of attack. I am going to heal with the Super Potion. Get Brittany to full and see what the frick this thing decides it wants to do. Before acting erratically. That would have been scary. But not really, because... Gosh dang it. Okay, I hate this game. I, I hate this game sometimes. Bruh. It's gonna... It's gonna... That's gonna do nothing because it's slower. Breathe in. Breathe out. Why would I make things to be a threat? Is it not a threat? But when I don't make it out to be a threat because I'm following somebody else and what they're wanting to do and why a, a major criticism that it is a threat and what the frick game? No matter what I can do, I'm in a position where I'm wrong. Oh wait, that sounds familiar. Anyway. <laughs> I did not give myself enough time. <laughs> uh, no, but... Oh, I didn't even heal. Okay, that was my bad. Okay, no, no matter what comes out here, I was stupid. Okay, like, 100% I was stupid on that. That is karma for being a bitch. 
That is karma for being a bitch. <laughs> Boy! Like, okay. I know I've swear like quite a bit in this episode, and I, 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 I apologize. Just let me have this one. <laughs> That's all I'll say. Just let me have this one. Oh my gosh. Joy's dad, the best person to help in these situations. That was me slamming my water bottle emphatically. What? <laughs> You know what? Actually... We're fighting in the, the way that I like to fight Pokemon. Because the game is being stupid. A crit does kill from here, though. I'm gonna heal. A crit does kill from there, so I gotta be safe. Uh, oh my god. I mean, that's literally gonna do nothing. <laughs> I mean, a crit still killed, though. A crit still killed, though. I cannot be mad. A crit still would have killed. Okay. No, no, no. I have. Let me deal with that. Policy. I mean, to be fair, my oof doesn't really hurt that much. Because a three hit K, it's, yeah. Oh my gosh. I was literally about to say, at a crit kills, like a three hit KO or a crit kills. <laughs> I mean, it didn't matter. A two hit KO kill too, but the fact that the crit actually did happen. Also, that's a typical. Uh, that's par poison, which makes this the problem. Tentacruel is a pain to fight. Okay. It really is not the mon that we need to be fighting right now. I'm gonna just deal with it, but it's not its not what I want to deal with. Oh. I read Tentacruel. Tentacruel is a problem. Tentacruel is whatever. Bye, Tentacruel. You're not dead. Jeez. I forget. Troy does not have any special attack. To save his life. Like, if I had to give Troy any... If I had to give Troy more special moves, I would literally just be insta-dead. And Brittany is leveling up really fast, so I gotta item take. I gotta take the item off, and I'm gonna give it. Uh, I'm gonna give it. Who do I even give it to? Like, honestly. I mean, I guess I can give it to Troy. Because let's be let let's let's be 100. percent What is Troy actually gonna crit like? Besides the one move, Joy's dad actually has a higher chance to crit than <laughs> most other Pokemon. I'd um, give. Um, there was something. Oh, yeah, you can get your bright powder back, actually. I was like, there was something that I wanted to give. Yep, yep. Nope, we figured, we figured it out. We, we did a good job. I had to fight you in order to get that. We're fighting you to get that. We are gonna fight you to get that though, because I want an item, and then you're you literally are fighting with any other. Cool. Th oh my gosh, Troy, get better, please. Don't get three hydro pumps hit upon you, my dude. Terrible ass. Troy literally, I uh, was out here like, yeah, I'm gonna get like three different hydro pumps get hit on me get multiple destroyed by 8,000 different things and then we're gonna deal with it and then we're gonna get a quick claw which is gonna make you sad because 
It's another item that you want Joy's dad to have. Joy's dad has so many different item combinations, it's actually ridiculous. Uh, like, keeping it a buck with y'all, Troy, like, or Joy's dad is gonna be an interesting, it's, it's a wild ride with Joy's dad. That... Oh my god, this is a freaking episode of disaster! <laughs> Any... <laughs> this is disastrous, okay. <laughs> Ah, uh, I can't recover. I'm sorry. I, I I have to apologize. I can't recover from that. I, I'm just, like, there's there is no recovering for that. Um. Yeah. So, anyways, moving on. Fighting end because we have to, not because we want to. Apparently not fighting end yet because we have to deal with this vinipede. The vinipede. Many different values mixed together and the world becomes gray. That is unforgivable. I will separate Pokemon and people and black and white clearly will be clearly distinct. Only then will people become perfect beings. Yes, that is my dream. That is my dream that I must fulfill. You have a dream? Oh my god, you gotta show me. Uh, show me your dream. You, you don't you don't wanna see those. You, you really don't. They're they're kind of Okay. <laughs> Not doing that again. <laughs> That's uh, weird. Okay. We're gonna kill the troll. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh. oh my god. This is this is just this is just this is just this. This is just what this is gonna be. And we gotta live with it. Because there's no going back now. Uh, just kill the thing. Another queen. This is the second queen. We got a queen and a troll. We got troll and her queen. Troll and her queen. Troll and his queen. God, freaking, I need to actually ex mentally exist, which is sometimes why I like the no cam that Joy and I do, because I don't have to just go like this and be like, drinking it on the camera, okay. You have learned the same move twice. Why? In the world. No. Why? In what universe did you think that I was going to teach you the same move twice? Uh, you know what, babe? Uh, we're going to get a crit and it won't matter oh you switch oh please actually get a crit please 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 <laughs> oh the crit didn't even matter that we didn't get a crit <laughs> wow i actually was fully expecting it to matter and it just didn't kind of was like you underestimate the power that i have and i'm like okay apparently i do and that scares me. Like, yes, you're not the typical bulky Pokemon of like, yes, I'm gonna do everything in my power to win. No, no. But you are in you are definitely scary. Um, you actually might have the highest attack on the team. Not special attack. Highest attack. Um, that still might go to Troy though. The code 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 name. Just a little further, and you'll be in Miss Stralton. Bianca, you have good ears. What? I can't believe you heard Code's voice from that far away. We're not even talk. Our character doesn't even talk. How can you hear a voice of somebody that can't talk? Professor Jennifer, what are you thinking? 
You appear to have no qualms about relationship between people and Pokemon. You put Pokemon into categories using arbitrary rules that you can un and, and think you can understand them like that. The very idea of the Pokedex revolts me. How do you have what do you have to say for yourself? Oh, you're not my biggest fan. Your opinion is understandable. But it happens to be different from mine, so it is also equally understandable. How about if we get to side for the uh, how or wait, is that Bianca or is that Juniper? How about we let Pokemon decide for themselves? Okay, I mean, like, I can see. I, I think that was Joy. I think that was Joy. We should let the Pokemon decide for themselves. Well, I didn't expect to see him change his mind right away. But uh, I hope he'll spend a little bit more time trying to understand how others feel, not just himself. Now then, I think I'll go collect a little more data. For Pokemon and people to get along better, we need to take these steps to learn about more. Okay, bye, Juniper. Um, Dawn, are you okay? I, uh, I'm gonna go with Juniper now because I'm her bodyguard. But, um, what the f was that? Also, did the sen <coughs> I also did the sen purposeful censor because <laughs> Joy doesn't curse, but. You get this sometimes if she's really upset you'll get stars from her, but she's she's never actually typed a curse or her Set a curse verbally, so I had to censor it because we love joy and we have to have an awesome Awesome representation Joy is amazing. Okay, again, I'm gonna say this again. Don't if you have not seen joy or not paid attention to joy You need to care about joy because joy is amazing and we all love her and I could go on a rant for hours about how Joy's amazing, and I probably shouldn't because I would bore the heck out of you guys. But on that fun note, we didn't get any encounters like I thought we were. Um, all we get to do is uh, get the Master Ball. Here, have a Master Ball. Oh, wait. Oh my gosh, wait, no way. We don't. There. <laughs> okay, I guess we don't get a master ball there, and I'm silly, and that's a different game that I'm thinking about. So yeah, I love you all so very much. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.